Good evening everyone and welcome to a new video on the channel. It is Friday the 3rd of March 2023 and tonight I'm heading to the Billingham Derby. It is Billingham Synthonia versus Billingham Town in Northern League Division 2. Although these days of course unfortunately uh, Sinners do not actually play their home games in Billingham nor did I play them in uh, neighbouring Norton on Tees which is where we saw them last season. Uh, these days, would you believe, they're actually playing the home games in Stokesley, of course, uh, which is south of even Middlesbrough. But this is the first time that these two have actually played each other since April 2017. So, uh, definite bragging rights at stake. Looking forward to it. Let's get into this. So, here I'm in Stokesley, and uh, before we go any further, I do have a bit of a correction to make. Uh, it was actually December 2018, the last time these two played against each other, and uh, they played each against each other twice that month. Uh, Town running out 4-0 winners at Norton in the first game, then the second game was a goalless draw, but even so, still quite a long time without playing each other and uh, quite a long time since Sinners last won this game it has to be said um, but going into this game this evening uh, Sinners are currently 12th in the Northern League Division 2 table and it's maybe uh, safe to say that uh, they're going to pretty much be a mid-table team for this season obviously the circumstances aren't ideal they're having to come down here for home games. Uh, as for Town, uh, they're currently in fourth place, I believe, and uh, in really good form just now. Uh, but as the saying, as is very cliche, uh, form often goes out the window in games like these. Like these, and uh, Sinners will be right up for this tonight. Uh, make no mistake about that. Uh, as it happens, I'm also doing the return fixture at Town. Uh, on the uh, 21st of April, so uh, we'll definitely be looking forward to that one as well. Uh, but uh, this is actually my third visit to Stokes in a season, and I've seen three different home teams. Obviously, uh, I was here to watch Stokesley Sports Club in July, then uh, Borough Rangers in October, and now Sinners tonight. Um, so far, I've seen a home win and a draw, after, so by that logic, I'll be seeing an away win tonight, but uh, sometimes that Kind of logic doesn't always come into it, but we'll soon find out. Let's head on down to Broughton Road and find out how it all unfolds. So the team's warming up, uh, Sinners getting ready just here. They're going to be in green and white this evening. And Towner uh, getting ready in the distance, of course, going to be in blue. Now it's time for the talking to stop and for the football to start. Ah, we're underway. Two Northern League games been to win a row with a drum. Oh, 
That's a save, that is. Well, that was in. Half time, Billingham Symphony and Hill, Billingham Town won. Uh, Town, I'd say, have a relative amount of control of the game, but uh, the scoreline isn't all that comfortable for them. I mean, it was a very well taken goal. I mean, a lovely flick into the feet of the lad that's uh, uh, put stuck the ball away. So stayed calm, stayed composed, hit, hit hard and low. Uh, so like can't really ask much more really, and uh, they could have made it two just before half time, but. Uh, a really good save by the by the Sinners keeper. As for Sinners, uh, they're knocking the ball about quite well, but uh, not really had anything too clear cut of yet. But uh, I think uh, how they start the second half is going to be a really important factor in this game. Uh, they can't afford to let themselves go 2 0 down, otherwise, I think from there it's probably. Good night, sweetheart. But uh, if they can stay in the game, uh, give Town a bit more to think about, then uh, they could well get back back in it from there. But uh, we'll see how it goes. Team that's going to comfortably survive, but. Goal. Really good strike. It's all kicked off now. Who needs a super classic on the old um, Billingham Derby is where it's at. It's reaching for a card. What colour is it going to be? Just a yellow. And a yellow for a Sinners player as well. Lovely. Oh. So I'll make it. We are now in the 90th minute. Um, I imagine there's going to be a bit of added time. Uh, there's a bit, quite a hold up just then. This is surely the last action of the game. Too slow.
Full time, Billingham Sinthonia 1, Billingham Town 1. Uh, I'd maybe say that is a fair result on a night, but uh, that was an absolutely unbelievable save by the Sinners keeper to uh, preserve them a point at the end. I mean, it looked for all the world as though uh, Town had won it, but uh, it trickled wide and uh, just got to take a hat off to him. Uh, I think uh, Sinners the started the second half pretty well and... Uh, Got a goal as a reward. I think they maybe finished the game a little bit quietly, but uh, I think they, they did the jobs quite well tonight. Um, and I think I think both teams will be fairly content with the result. Uh, I mean, I expect Town will uh, be in the playoffs come the end of the season. Uh, Sinners, as I said, they'll. Uh, most likely be mid table, but uh, the thing is, it, it extends Towns' unbeaten run, and uh, Sinners haven't been in the best of form of late. So I, th- I think they'll, they'll they'll take that all the same. Uh, like it was, it was a good, it was a good fought out game, and I'd say a, a fairly decent advert for uh, the Northern League. Um, it wasn't. A major amount of chances on the night, but uh, I think that was to be expected. But uh, certainly a bit of need, wasn't it? A bit of a a twenty-two man scuffle uh, towards the end of the game. Uh, the uh, uh, town players put in a challenge that the Sinners players weren't happy with. Uh, the Sinners players gone over, they shoved him, and then it's all just uh, got a bit argy bargy from there. Uh, then uh, the referee was forced to. Go over to the dugout. It all happened. Uh, I've got to say, though, the, yep, uh, most definitely enjoyed it. But that is that for this video, and I'll be back tomorrow with Gateshead versus Chesterfield. So, a massive game at both ends of the National League table. Until then, take care. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you later.